The Ontario government came out with its new plan today for two of the province's landmark tourist attractions. The province confirmed that it's moving the Ontario Science Centre to Ontario Place on the waterfront and the whole development is getting a makeover. Al Sweeney was covering the story today and joins us live in studio with the latest. Al. Taz, there's no question that these two attractions need work. They're both old and in various stages of being run down. But critics of the government say it should have asked ordinary people what they want before announcing these sweeping changes. Ontario Place has been in operation since 1971 and is showing its age. Facilities closed down for years. The Science Centre is even older, from 1969. Now they're going to be renewed and combined in one location on the water. The new revitalized Ontario Place is a once-in-a-generation opportunity. Premier Doug Ford made the announcement today that the Ontario Science Centre and Toronto's Don Mills will be moved to Ontario Place in 2025. And Ontario Place will be refurbished with new facilities, trails, a beach, business opportunities and a larger concert stage. We're building a destination for the world and the country and the people of Ontario to come here. With part of the development, the new Science Centre, although smaller than the existing one. That building where it stands right now is 52 years old and getting older by the day. So the, the common space, the redesign of the Science Centre will be state-of-the-art, next generation. And for a government focused on housing, Ford says the old Science Centre's site will be replaced with new homes that the province needs. One of the main concerns about these announcements today is that these decisions were all made behind closed doors. They haven't been consulting with the people of Ontario who own the Ontario Science Centre and who own Ontario Place. And they're concerned that a large part of the new Ontario Place development is going to be a luxury spa run by an Austrian company. But the Premier says he's doing what he was elected to do. Folks, we live in a democracy. We received a strong mandate from the people of Ontario in the last election. And we're going to move on uh, the items that we, we talked about during the election. Ontario Place was one of them. This is really going to be spectacular. It really is. So there was a lot of talk today about spectacular and state-of-the-art and world-class. But one of the outstanding questions is how much is this going to cost there is no answer so far. The Premier says those details will be announced once they work them out.